Has anyone heard about this old Pixar movie, A Bug's Life? It's a movie about an ant named Flick, who teams up with a team of circus insects to fight a band of evil grasshoppers led by Hopper, an evil greedy grasshopper who only wants food from the ants. I watched it, like a couple of years ago, and I pretty much enjoyed it. However, one incident left me shocked for my entire life. In 2007, I found a VHS tape on the ground while I was walking home after a day of swimming practice. It said, don't watch, Pixar Confidential Tape. I popped it into my VCR anyways. The tape started with static for 5 minutes. The scene was the near ending climax of the movie, A Bug's Life, where Hopper cornered Flick into the bird's nest. The scene was violent, an example was Hopper choking Flick coughing. The bird then sees Hopper doing the dreadful deed. Thinking it is a trick with the blueberry scouts inside, Hopper immediately realized and he was shocked. The bird roared at him, but the roar was Godzilla's roar, and it was extremely loud. I turned down the volume, but I could still hear the deafening roar. Hopper screamed as he walked out, but the bird caught him. As Hopper was almost going to die, the bird stabs him with its beak and carries him to its chicks. Somehow, Hopper is still alive and he was screeching for help. Instead of carrying Hopper down, the bird immediately dropped Hopper down to its chicks. The screen cuts to black and I could hear blood curdling screams. Soon, an image of Hopper appeared on screen while dark and offbeat music played. Hopper was dead, his left eye was across and his other eye was dangling from the socket. His mouth started leaking blood and his wings were ripped out. One of his arms were ripped out as well. The music that was playing was dreadful. I tried lowering down the volume, but it wouldn't let me. I yelled for help but realized I was alone. The screen turned black and then a message appeared saying, 1995, Pixar Animation Studios. The tape popped out of the VCR and I popped it back in to get some footage. I uploaded the footage to YouTube, and I ended up selling the tape to eBay. Where it is out there somewhere, where someone now can buy and watch this disturbing tape.